What's up, Power Maniacs? Parastasis here, and today I'm going to show you guys how to use the advanced chat features that owned 3D.TV offers. Uh, first off, you're going to need an IRC client. With the IRC client, you can use a MyRC, you can use, well, I don't know any other names, but Wayne uses a different one, and apparently there's a million different versions, so use whichever one you want to use. Okay, so once you've got your MIRC client, I'm going to be showing you how to do it with MIRC. If you're using a different client, you'll need to figure that one out on your own or find a tutorial or something. They're, they're not real hard. Okay, so you click File, you click Select Server, and you're going to get this window here. Now, we're going to click on connect. You need to type your name in here. And this is the name you want to go by. Uh, this name is how you'll be identified in chat. So, you know, pick whatever. Pick appropriate. Please don't make me ban you because you're coming in with like, you know, Nazi, Hitler, pedophile, whatever the hell name you want to pick. Anyways, once you've got your name and, and use a name, don't use a phrase. It makes it so much easier for me to identify it if you have a name. Um... And it doesn't have to be the same as your own 3D account. You can come in here with anything you want. It's up to you. Um, don't matter to me. Once you got your name, you want to click on servers. And servers, you're looking for QuakeNet. Now you're going to see a list of servers. You're actually going to see two lists of servers. If you notice right here, you've got Ryzen through 2600 net. And then you've got abjects and everything below here is alphabetical. These are the big servers. These are, these are the nice places to hang out. This is the ghetto down here. Uh, QuakeNet should be in the nice servers. Uh, you click on the folder and it will pop out like this and then you select one. I use random uh, because it connects to the best server that it can get a hold of. You can pick whichever one you want. You know, if you're in the UK or DE or I have no idea what SE is, but if you're there, click that one. Uh, click select here in the bottom left and it'll drop you back to connect. You'll notice that this right here has now selected your server and then you can just click on connect and it will connect you here. The room, you're going to get a little pop-up in the center of your screen that asks you which room you want to join. Just type in pyrostasis, P-Y-R-O-S-T-A-S-I-S, -S -S, and that will get you here. And in this room right here, you will be able to chat with us. And you'll also be able to chat with everybody over here because the chat is the same. As you can see, we'll make a little arrow. Arrow shows up over here. Let me make another little arrow. And it shows up over here. So you can easily chat back and forth uh, with the folks, whether they're using the web interface or whether you're just using the IRC interface. It's up to you. Uh, the interface over here has got some nice little functions. You know, you can select stuff, you can tweet it, you can copy it, you can translate it apparently into, you know, cling on if you want. Uh, the only problem is over here, I do believe some words are censored. So, you know, you can't be profane. Whereas over here, you can pretty much say whatever you want within reason. Okay, folks, within reason. So let's, let's keep it reasonable, or otherwise my admins will have to dust off the band hammer and crush you like a gnat. So all of my admins will be in here shortly, and this is a chat system that we will be using for pretty much the perceivable future. We're going to stick with pyrostasis for now. We had went with TDK pyrostasis, but somebody beat me to the room and is now holding the ops. So we will just stick here. So. Anyways, that's pretty much it for this tutorial. That should allow you to get in and easily see what's going on. If you have any questions, problems, or concerns, leave them in the comment section below. Click the like button if you found it helpful. Make sure you subscribe, and I'll catch you guys in the next clip.